Well, Elvira's Cafe is a popular restaurant in the Wares Valley area. Owner Elvira Grant says she always wants her customers to feel like family. But what do you do when you can't have customers? WAT6 on your side reporter Kristen Galan shares how this restaurant owner reached out to her community during the Wares Valley wildfires. Elvira's Cafe is in the middle of Wares Valley, and for days, this road was closed due to the wildfires. But instead of sticking it out at home, their employees decided to get to work for those working hard to put these fires out. For a kid who came from the Soviet Union originally, and uh, to be believed in, and then when you see such a leg up for yourself, you feel like you need to give back. Elvira's Cafe has been a staple in Wears Valley for 10 years. The idea was when we first opened up, the idea was to be a place of uh, home away from home for everybody. And when their home was threatened by the recent fires and Elvira's Cafe had to close its door to customers, their employees decided to reach out to their neighbors, preparing meals for first responders. We are so thankful for all these guys that just came out from every corner of the state, country, you know, and just helped us. While this cafe owner was helping those in her community, she says she's also thinking about her family and friends overseas. I have my mom and uh, uh, my families, uh, my brother, uh, they're still in Russia, in Siberia. Uh, uh, it's a diff difficult situation right now, world-wise, and uh, I'm praying every day that uh, the peace comes, that there's no more war. She says as an immigrant, she's thankful for the opportunities she's been given here in the States, and she says it's her duty to continue to give back. It's a true God's blessing to know that you're in a country where people really love you, support you. Elvira says none of her employees lost their homes in these fires, but she says that they'll be there for anyone needing assistance. Reporting in Wears Valley, Kristen Gallant, WATE 6 on your side. Kristen, thank you so much. Now the cafe is planning to host a fundraiser for Wears Valley Volunteer Fire Department in August. Elvira says she'll share more details soon.